Hey, uh, YouTube, this is King Cobra JFS. What? In the video. Why'd you turn that on? For a second. Got the fan going because it's a wee bit hot in the apartment. Just a wee bit. And, uh, yeah. But, uh, check this out. We got Rockstar Limeade Freeze. Let's do a quick review of it. Um, yeah, I like the uh, black and green can. That's very uh, sharp looking. Frozen lime, huh? Alrighty. I've had it before. It's pretty good. You should make some bomb ass margaritas. Go on some of this and some margarita mix and some. You do a rock star wine freeze with tequila, margarita mix, maybe some some rum, maybe some Bacardi 151, you know what I'm saying? You get all kinds of fuck it up. You get bomb ass margarita and clean that much, huh? But th that's definitely a nice way to cool things off on a hot summer day. You haven't seen me on YouTube in quite some time, but um, my internet went down for a couple of days, so yeah. But um, I'm sure it's always nice to have fresh content. All right, it's chugging time. Four. Three, two, one. <sighs> Damn it. Can't chug it as quick as I probably could. Oh well. Uh. Excuse me. Damn. I guess there is no excuse for me, is there? <laughs> is there anything new going on in my life right now? Well, about a week and a half ago, or might have been shorter than that, but... I had a customer call the 1-800 number for Wendy's and um, complained that I stink. I'm like, excuse me, I shower and wash my clothes, so how do I stink exactly? But uh, the incident has since passed, so it's whatever. I took care of the issue, obviously. Considering that I work for the Wendy's, which in question is ranked number three in the nation. I'm not bullshitting you. The Wendy's I work the Wendy's I work at is ranked number three in the nation. And my clock in number is four. Ain't that something? Ain't that something? Ah, refreshing. Oh yeah, you can make some bomb use like some which um what is it? Um uh, Jose Cuervo, or you know what I'm saying, like a, this Jose Cuervo silver tequila to go with this. Oh, damn. Although I'd probably do like the Jose Cuervo black to go with this green. That'd look really cool for a uh, margarita mix. <laughs> like, what's this? Is it black and green margarita? What is this? Just drinking. Oh, yeah. <coughs> Shit. Oof. A thing about um, energy drinks, though, they uh, they give you the burps. Nothing like free advertising, though. I'll tell you what. So, um, and Rockstar's come out with a couple of decent flavors too. They got um, the mango one's pretty good. Uh, the blueberry one's dank. They also have the Rock Rockstar Booms, the strawberry one. I've had it. And they have one that tastes like orange sherbet. And these two are the, the rock.
Rockstar Bones aren't carbonated as far as I remember. But, um, yeah. A can crush for my friends. Gauntlet ring and all, baby. Uh. Uh, that time was. Very refreshing. Gave me a nice little caffeine jitter there. <laughs> Ooh. And um, oh yeah, charming as always when you, when you get the um the burps from your rock stars and all that. But here we are with some Marlboro NXTs. These are basically Mar Marlboro's version of a Camel Crush. They start off as regular cigarettes, but when you crush the bead in the filter, they turn to menthol. And I like them. They're good cigarettes. It's just a uh, couple things. One thing I noticed is that the flavor when you first crush the bead on a Marvel NXT, when you first break that filter of that uh, menthol cartridge trying to taste the best. It's got that um, delicious taste to it, but then that sort of fades, and then it it turns into a very, 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 very mild menthol. So overall, not a bad cigarette as far as cigarettes go, but yeah. If they can find, if they find a way to make that flavor when you first crush the bead like last through the entire cigarette, versus just fading, you know what I'm saying? But I, that's not my call to make. Other than that, it's not half bad for a cigarette, you know what I'm saying? Me too, you know what I'm saying? Um, I need to get more Zippo wick, because the Zippo I have, I guess, yeah, it needs a new wick. Good thing tomorrow's painting, right? <laughs> and of course, it wouldn't be a, uh, wouldn't be a King Cobra video without, um, some guitar playing. And I'm going to upload another video in the process while I'm recording this one. Because I can, goddammit. about three minutes till that's done publishing. Cool. In the meantime, back to this one here. And the one video I recorded that I'm uploading right now to YouTube, I recorded it 
couple weeks ago, about a week ago. I've been meaning to upload it to YouTube, but I haven't had a chance to do it. Pop that menthol bead. Pop that menthol bead. When my guitar's not working, and oh, look at that, the amp cord's not plugged in. Well, that probably would help a little bit, you think? Maybe. Maybe, just maybe. Thank <laughs> you. 
greatest guitarist, but at least I'm trying to get better. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
the versatility of guitar. I want to play a little bit of ACDC on the drop D here. <laughs> Alexandria. result of taking on several songs at once. Because if I can if I can play for release and I can learn any fucking song out there really it's not that difficult just a matter of practice and all that good stuff. Um <laughs> Thank <laughs> you. 
playing to, uh, you know, get things kicking off right. <clears throat> but, uh, yeah, thanks for watching me play guitar. This is King Cobra JFS with another video. And, um, thanks for watching. See y'all later. <laughs>